Hello there. Today, I have to tell you about a couple of doctors who have been in deep research and believe that they have identified a protein and it will help block or impede inflammation in type 1 diabetes. Now, you know that that is the scourge of diabetes. Inflammation leads to all kinds of catastrophic things, including loss of eyesight, heart disease, uh, kidney failure, etc. Well, we want to hear what these doctors have to say because they think that they may have found a solution to this problem. Let's talk about it together here on Type 1 Diabetic Warriors. Thanks for joining us today. If you like our channel's content, feel free to hit the link in the description and buy us a coffee. We appreciate all our viewers who support our channel. Now on to our video. Scientists hack the code to stop diabetic inflammation. For the 38 million Americans with diabetes, the daily grind of finger pricks and meal planning is a relentless battle. But the most dangerous fight isn't about blood sugar. It's a silent war of inflammation being waged deep inside your cells. This invisible inflammation is a destructive force, leading to blindness, kidney failure, and heart disease. For decades, treatments only controlled glucose, letting the fire smolder. But what if scientists could finally put it out by hacking the very code that triggers the damage? To understand this breakthrough, you have to know the villain. In diabetes, high blood sugar creates harmful molecules called advanced glycation end products, or AGEs, sticky gunk that builds up in tissues. This gunk trips a cellular alarm, activating a protein called RAID, the receptor for advanced glycation end products. Once activated, RAGE finds its partner inside the cell, a protein called DIAF1. Normally helpful, DIAF1 turns toxic when overstimulated by RAGE. Together, they kickstart a chain reaction, unleashing a flood of inflammatory signals. This isn't helpful short-term inflammation. It's a chronic assault that fuels the scariest complications of diabetes. For years, this destructive rage diaf one duo has operated unchecked. Current drugs only clean up the damage. They don't stop the source of the inflammation, leaving a huge gap in care for both type 1 and type 2 diabetes. A team of scientists at the University at Albany and NYU Grossman School of Medicine asked, what if you could break that connection? They believed stopping RAGE and DIAF1 from interacting could shut down the entire inflammatory cascade at its source. Led by co-senior authors Professor Alexander Schechtman and Dr. Anne-Marie Schmidt, the team first built a 3D model of how the proteins connect. With this blueprint, they screened molecules, searching for a decoy to block that connection. They found it, a molecule they named RAGE-406R. RAGE-406R binds to the exact spot on RAGE where DIH1 would attach, physically blocking it. This stops the inflammatory signal before it starts. But would it work in practice? The team tested RAGE-406R on human immune cells from patients with type 1 diabetes and saw a significant drop in inflammatory signals. Next, they applied it to wounds on diabetic mice. The results were striking. Rage 406R dramatically sped up healing, proving that blocking this single molecular interaction could have a real, measurable effect. This discovery represents a new horizon of hope. By targeting the Rage DIF1 pathway, scientists are hitting a central mechanism behind many complications, from kidney to heart disease. Crucially, because Rage 406R targets a universal inflammatory pathway, it could fill a major treatment gap showing promise for complications in both type 1 and type 2 diabetes. This success also highlights scientific persistence. An earlier candidate, RAGE-229, failed a safety test. The team learned from this, redesigning the molecule to create the safer, yet still powerful, RAGE-406R. So what's next? The molecule is still in the preclinical stage. Rigorous testing is needed before human trials can begin and researchers are working to move it forward. This discovery changes the conversation about diabetes from one of management to one of intervention, a future where long-term complications are no longer seen as inevitable. To stay updated on this research and other medical breakthroughs, make sure you subscribe. For decades, the fight against diabetes has focused on blood sugar. Now, scientific code breakers have opened a new front going inside the cell to shut down a core driver of the disease's worst complications. While the road is long, the discovery of RAID 406R offers more than a new strategy. 
It offers a powerful scientific reason for hope that the silent war of diabetic inflammation can finally be stopped. Well, I like the name anyway, Rage 406R, because uh, we've been raging on about this disease for many years, uh, at least in my case, and I'm sure in yours as well. But I'm very optimistic that uh, this, in theory, is a great idea. Cutting off the pathway to this inflammation uh, would be a boon toward a diabetes cure. So they need to bring these into clinical studies uh, with human beings, and hopefully that's coming up soon. My name is Jim, and I want to hear your comments on this and anything else that you want to hear about on Diabetic Warriors. And uh, we'll talk to you again real soon here. You have a great day, and keep those blood sugars under control.